G'day guys, Jack from Keg and Go here, and I'm here today to show you how to fill a 19 litre corny keg. Firstly, we'll run over some basics of a corny keg. It's very easy, there's nothing too hard. We have two posts here. This one's the out post for liquid to come out of. It's marked just down there. Then we have the in post, and that's for gas to go in. Gas needs to go in to push the liquid out. Uh, generally, the kegs should be pressurized, so we need to make sure that we unpressurize them before we lift the lid off. To do that, we open the pressure relief valve just here by pulling on this ring. Uh, you'll soon be able to hear the gas come out. And that was all the gas. So now we lift this latch up towards us like that. We push down on the lid. We rotate clockwise, push down on the lid and then lift out. It's as simple as that. Now we have the opening of the keg open, we can now fill that with whatever beverage we like. We do strongly suggest that you slowly fill the keg. If you uh, fill it fast, it tends to froth up and then it won't pour very well and you won't get 19 litres actually in the keg itself. Uh, we also strongly suggest maybe putting a handful of ice in if you want to pour from it quickly. Otherwise, make sure you put it into the system straight away so it has time to chill down to an optimal temperature range of about three degrees. So once your liquid's back in there and it's all full, probably just below the lid, you can put it back in by pretty much doing the opposite. So we put it in, spin anti-clockwise, lift up so the rubber is seated around the rim, then push down on this latch like so. It is also important that we then purge any oxygen that's in there so nothing goes stale. So to do so, you need to connect the liquid line once again. And it's pretty easy. You just chuck that one back on the in post here. Just for a couple of PSI, it's not too much drama. It's this ring here, we're gonna pull up again. Just for a couple of seconds. Stop, take it back off. And then you should be good to go. Just lift the keg inside the system, hook up the liquid line to the outlet, hook up the gas to about 12 psi, and uh, yeah, as long as it's uh, down to about three degrees, it should be good to pour. Sometimes that can take a couple of hours, but uh, we always suggest any of the mixes you put in, you've had in the fridge already. So normally you should be able to pour pretty quickly. Cheers.